Hey, it's Thea Daniels with Raw Vlogcast. I got Tim Carmen over here, and he is with GA20. GA20, that's right, yep. And they are doing a coastal tour, and so I get to talk with people who are real, authentic, and willing to share their passion, and just about the coolest people in the whole wide world. So, hey, this guy can play the drums. So, tell us, how long have you guys been playing together? Uh, GA20's been around about five years now. Yeah, it started like 2018, and I joined the band about a year into the project, so. And how long have you been playing the drums? Have they always been what's lit yeah, you up? Pretty much. Uh, my older brother was a punk guitarist, and he started a band, and I joined his band when I was about 10 years old, actually. I was gigging around Boston and <laughs> playing in basements and playing with some other punk bands and stuff like that, so it was good. He got me, he basically handed me the sticks and said, I need a drummer, you're going to play drums, and that's how it started, so. Oh, wow, yeah. great big brother. Yeah, yes. And so punk was what got you inspired? Yeah, pretty much, yeah, punk rock, yeah. Favorite band? Uh, I'd have to say Dead Kennedys in that world. I like the Dead Kennedys, The Clash, Operation Ivy, that type of stuff, mm -hmm. yeah, which is, I actually, I took an Uber ride today and I was talking to the driver and he was like, oh, I used to be in a punk band. He's like, oh, we, we toured with the Dead Kennedys. And I was, so we, we started talking about You're my biggest fan. Yeah, I was like, oh, that's awesome. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and so, uh, is it the the punk, the only thing that's inspired you? Or is oh, other music influenced you? A lot you? of other music. So that was when I was younger. And then I got into jazz. Uh, I studied a lot of jazz. Roy Haynes, uh, Philly Joe Jones, stuff like that. A lot mm -hmm. of jazz drummers. And then from that, branched into blues and other Americana roots music, I'd say. So, I, I'm all over the all over the spectrum. That's why you guys know Bill with his Americana. Yes, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, just, I actually just met Bill tonight for the first time. Great, great guy though. Matt's, Matt's loves him. He talks about him a lot, so. <laughs> it's good to meet good people. Yes, it is. Okay, so you were telling us, because we were talking about COVID and- Yes music and this is their new live cd our but live record right there go ahead and tell us a little bit about uh so yeah we recorded that record i believe it was january or february in 2020 and we went out to loveland ohio which is where our record label is based out of cool. and on the trip out there i started feeling a little sick um we get there we spend the night wake up the next day um i feel like absolute crap so I, I take a bunch of Sudafed, blah, blah, blah. I'm really out of it. We record the show, of course, and that's what that record turned out to be. And I'm pretty sure I had COVID. <laughs> it was like right at the beginning of COVID. Oh. So yes, I had COVID while I was playing drums on that record, yeah. And that, the music keeps you going. <laughs> I'll be honest with you, I, I personally can't listen to that record because I hate the way I play because I'm so hopped up on Sudafed the whole show. So that's another funny story for you. That is a funny story. <laughs> yeah, even the greats, they they get Critical. down. Critical. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's the way it is. Yeah. So. Is there any other good stories about what you've done and where you've done it? You said that you grew up on the California coast. I grew up in Boston, but I lived outside of Los Angeles for a little bit. I lived in Michigan for a little bit. And now I'm back in outside of Boston. I live in Springfield, Massachusetts. And I also have a jazz trio under my own name called the Tim Carmen Trio. And I have some books I'm putting out too, some drum instruction books. So lots of things going on. Sure. So can we find you like on YouTube or yeah, anything YouTube. with those instructions? Yep, Amazon. Uh, Hudson Music is the drum company that I release books with. You can get my books there as well. So yeah, check them out. Tim Carmen. I got four out right now. Another one coming out soon. So. And tell us a little bit about this jazz band. Uh, it's called the Tim Carmen Trio. It's kind of like an organ soul project, like a la Jimmy Smith, Big John Patton. Wow. Like 60s, okay. blue note, soul, soul jazz stuff. So yeah, it's fun. Guitar, organ, and drums. So. Any dreams that you have out there with playing music around this the This is pretty much it right now, honestly. Going we're, coastal. We're, we're making money and we're, we're playing shows and getting in the van and meeting different people and exploring mm -hmm. the world. I mean, it's, you can't really beat that. So. so you guys are cruising around in a van. Yes, and we're, we're going to Europe again soon. And we got another record coming out soon. We got a lot of stuff going on, so. All right, and where are you headed to next? You're in Santa Rosa, I, California, or Sebastopol, California. Yeah, I think Santa Cruz is next. We're going to Sacramento. I'll be honest with you, I just kind of wake up and get in the car <laughs> and see where we're going. So I know we're going down the coast. We're okay. going to be in LA, and then we're going across to Texas, and then we end up at uh, 
the New Orleans Jazz Festival. We're playing out there as well, so. Oh man, that's yeah. stunning. I'm going to be going down to uh, San Diego for Gator by the Bay. And oh, I cool. know a bunch of people from the New Orleans Festival yeah, will yeah, be yeah. going there. It's I terrific. love San Diego too, one of my favorite cities. Good, good <laughs> it, city. is, yeah. it is beautiful. <laughs> so with uh, anything that you'd like to share, you know, words you live by with getting to do what you love and, and do it well? That's a, that's a tough question. I'd say whatever you want to do, just go for it, because you could fail at stuff you don't want to do, so you might as well try to do stuff you want to do. So that's kind of how I how I live. <laughs> I don't think better words have been said. Yeah, awesome. You might as well do what you love. Yeah, okay, yeah. how can we follow you? Uh, we'll follow GA20 Band. You mm -hmm. can go to our Instagram, which is GA20 Band, or GA20Band.com. Um, yeah, I'd say start there. Okay, so, yeah. and then he told you about his trio, and yep. if you're into jazz and all that good yep. stuff, yep. Thank Thank you so much. Thank I you. get to share you all over the world. Beautiful. Love it. Great awesome. to meet you. Cheers. Thanks. <laughs> nice to meet you too. Yeah.